Urban explorers hoping to see the decaying carcass of a great white shark at a deserted wildlife park in Victoria have been warned by police to keep away. The shark was discovered floating in a tank of formaldehyde at the creepy derelict wildlife park in base in the state's east. The dilapidated building has since been inhabited by squatters and is scattered with litter, broken furniture, old appliances, torn wallpaper and shattered windows. Inside a pitch black shed is the dead 5-meter great white shark suspended in a green-tinted tank of formaldehyde, a chemical used to preserve dead bodies. The shark was found dead in 1998 in tuna finishing nets in South Australia. Police are urging people to stay away from the rundown sanctuary warning they could face prosecution if caught exploring the site. Please keep away, I watch Base Coast Police Service Area posted on Facebook. We understand that numerous members of the public are attending the site to visit the shark. Please be advised that this location is on private property, so we advise the public not to attend the area. You run the risk of being charged with trespassing offenses. The deserted park was closed in 2012 by the Department of Sustainability and Environment due to offenses against wildlife and for not holding a license to display native animals to the public. The operator was unable to obtain a license to run the premises, was evicted and surrendered all the wildlife to the RSPCA and the Department of Sustainability. When the operator evacuated the premises, no new home was found for the shark. Trespassing YouTubers bravely explored the sanctuary in a 30 minute video, which has gained over 9. Five million views since it was posted in November. The pair were confronted with the foul smell of possum feces upon entering the abandoned property. They stumbled upon the tank filled with murky green water and were stunned when they realized the mysterious shark was floating inside. What the hell, can you guys see that? One said dot that is creepy as piles of clothing, family pictures, Food in the fridge and furniture such as couches, a mattress and a television set was evidence squatters occupied the rural building. Expired half-empty bottles of milk were found dated back to April 2016 as well as a shopping catalogue from 2015.